always loved music. Hopped around with a few different instruments and I was introduced to cello. I just fell in love with it. I just always had this spark in me to be a star. When I came in street perform, I would play whatever I want. Nothing was wrong, everything was right the way I did it. I was okay, I think this is my niche. This is my thing, shining my light on all these people that I meet every day. Music became my life. I am classically trained, and I do a lot of R&B, hip hop, any genre I can play, from country to gospel, to rock music, you can definitely step into different barriers with cello. And to think that I can, in some way, give that gift to other people. Just making someone smile if they had a bad day, that like warms my heart. I'm happy that I'm able to do something like that with something that I love. Just to let people know that it's okay to be different, it's okay to do something different, even if, if it's not cello. They might just be inspired by me doing something that is out of the ordinary. I'm different, you know, and if you're different, it's okay, and, and we're cool. But wherever I feel like I can push my essence of music, I'm there. <laughs> My name is IJ. I'm a cellist. I've been street performing for about 10 years now. I've been studying classical music since I was six. When I began playing cello, I didn't know where cello was. I wasn't really a fan of it. It was so big, it was intimidating. My music teacher brought her cello in one day for the students. Just from her having a professional case, I was like, this is cool. She brought it out and she started to play Bach Prelude. And it's the first thing I've heard on cello ever. She just... And I was just like, Whoa, I was so amazed. It was like nothing I'd seen before, and she was so beautiful, and it was so much poise. From that day, I decided that I'm going to be a cellist. Whatever I have to do, how much I have to practice, I want to do that. So a few of my friends, we started to street perform. People would come up to me and just say, do you play for weddings? And I would say, yeah, I can. After that, I started to become more of a professional. When I started when I was 14, you know, the first day I was just so terrified to play, and now I'm so comfortable, and, and now I feel like I'm being my full self. I have a lot of faith in my talent, and I really trust myself, and I think that this is awesome that I'm doing it. I want to see way more people like me doing the same thing in the future. The things that I witness and the people that I meet, I feel like I can't get that joy, the same joy on a stage all the time. I never know who I'm going to meet, or I never know who's going to see my talent. I think that the spontaneousness of it is really what feeds me, I and mean, I feel like I will always shoot before him. I feel like I'm stepping off into the orchestra stage, the concert hall, and I'm stepping onto my own stage to continue to spread my music just around the world, just show everybody what I do. 